let's do an unboxing, review, and setup of this Logitech webcam. Hey everyone, how's it going? My name is Jewel Tolentino, and on this channel, we show you how to create profitable content. This is the Logitech C930E webcam, which was our old webcam. This literally died last week after using it since 2014, 15, almost 3000 recorded videos with this exact webcam on our YouTube channel, Zoom meetings, all of our courses we recorded with this. So this died last week, so that's why we got this one. Let's get into the unboxing. All right, so let's do the unboxing of this Logitech 4K webcam. Previously, we were using this, the Logitech C930E webcam. So literally this one died last week. And now we're doing the unboxing of the Logitech 4K webcam. Okay, let's unbox this thing. I plan to use this webcam just as long as I used this one. And we'll show you test footage as well. Comes in a box like this. Let's see what it comes with. Ooh, here we go. So you can see the difference here. Definitely a much more modern look to it. Let's take it out. Oh, it's got a heavier body for sure. Cause I can feel it's cold to the touch here. So it's got like a metal feel to it. Definitely feels more robust than this one. The cords. Oh, interesting. Okay. So this had a cord attached to it, right? It was always attached. This is separate. So you can see there's no cord here. And we've got the connection cord. We've got the connection here, USB, and then the connection to the camera here. I'm gonna show this on an actual setup, on our actual computer setup to show you what it looks like. And then we've got this quick guide here. This is the Logitech Brio 4K webcam. It's got this thing. I'm assuming this is the cover. Yes. Okay. I think it is because I was really hoping that there would be a cover. And we've got a carrying case. That's always useful because probably we're going to be traveling with this. So we've got a nice big carrying case to put everything in. I'll probably also still use this box as well, just to, when we're traveling, just to secure it, right? Because this is a, uh, it's cloth, but you know, if you drop it, it still might get damaged. That looks like it just fits on like that. So I'm gonna remove the plastic and let's set this up on an actual computer. All right, so I've got the webcam right here. We're just gonna take off all this stuff, nice and premium. This right here. Why did they wrap it like this? They really wrapped it around here, which is really interesting. I'm not sure what's going on over here. Okay, there was some s sliding and MacGyvering to get that off. Just be gentle with it. And you can see that it slides open like this. And this is very similar to the old one. So I know exactly how this is gonna sit on the laptop. There's one more piece up here that we want to remove just so that we can get it nice and premium <laughs> packaging. And then we've got the connection cord here. So I'm going to unwrap this and then I'm just gonna reattach that so that it doesn't get snagged on anything. And then this part goes into the Logitech on, on the back and then connect. I'm gonna put the cover on I'm so glad that they provided this. So it just sits on top here, really nice and gently. And then you just like are able to just flip it up and close it whenever you please. This is the general setup here. And then depending on your setup, like how wide it, this is gonna be, this is, we're actually doing a presentation like in 20 minutes. So that's why I'm setting this up right now. YouTube for business is the presentation that we're about to do. So we need this webcam to get going. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna place this on top of the screen. So this can fit on a laptop and you can see a very wide monitor. And you just wanna fit it snugly 
I'm not sure if you can just reach around and see behind there if you want to you can see what it looks like so it just fits like snugly on there now the cord we need USB and so this is going to we can actually make this a little bit smaller if we want maybe something like this so that's why I always have it down here at the end and we can redo that and re cord this up and then this will go here to our USB dock that we have here and this has been very useful if you need to plug in a bunch of stuff. Now it's plugged in, and then we just need to adjust this accordingly. All right, so we've got it all connected up. It's literally just a plug and play, which means you plug it in and then it does its thing, and then you go to wherever you wanna use the camera. So this is StreamYard right here, and I'm just gonna to go to settings, and then make sure we choose the correct camera, which is the Logitech Brio. Okay, sounds like brioche bread. Just switch it to that. And then it's gonna be loading up. And then I'm going to open this. And then there we are in HD. Wow, it actually looks really good. So we're gonna exit out of that. And this is our streaming, uh, our streaming software. So we are gonna be using this on Zoom. I can see that it's already HD. I can see that very well. So that's actually really cool. But so far, initial thoughts, I'm like, wow, this is so much clearer than this one, which was good, which it was an HD, but this one is 4K HD. After releasing over 2,500 videos on this channel, that's three videos a week, plus live streams, we've really gotten producing videos for YouTube consistently down to a system. All right, so that is the unboxing, setup, and test of the Logitech Brio 4K webcam. So far, I'm loving it. I think it's really cool. I love that it comes with a cover. Love the carrying case, because we're gonna be traveling with this. And I hope to use this for another five to 10 years until it dies out. If you guys are interested in getting this webcam, head down to the description below, as I will have the Amazon links for you. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.